It is now 10.58 on Friday the 5th of November. It's Guy Fawkes night, so there's a lot of fireworks going on in the background and the night sky is being lit up. And not very long ago has Bev started to experience what seems to be regular contractions. We are just setting up for um, a home birth potentially water birth so yeah we will see how it all goes by god's grace smoothly without any hiccups not very long ago as well did bev put down ezra to sleep as actually i think probably while ezra was going off to sleep that she noticed contractions coming on because she only told me when she came out of his room yeah exciting times exciting times we've just been Moving all the cushions off the settee and um, throwing them in that corner. So a few things we were advised to get in preparation for a home birth. Some absorbent pads, <laughs> puppy training pads, but um, we will use them for all purposes. Hot water bottle, torch, a mirror, towels, and there are plenty more upstairs shower curtain so just a waterproof um sheet that we'd have needed but we always had a bouncy ball and this is um the birthing pool which i'm in the midst of inflating so i'll fill that up with air <laughs> in the first instance there's a liner that goes inside and um, that's this well disposable so that will protect the pool this pool is rented so we have to return it clean and tidy and dry so we use a liner on the inside that um, will protect the pool and then can be discarded afterwards. Contractions are happening. Baby is coming. I think I wasn't too sure before. I just thought it was like, you know, like I wasn't too sure if it was contraction or contraction. But I think now I'm sure. Because mm. you're just feeling a little bit more. Mm. Firma, more not firma. <laughs> I actually feel like a bit of sharpness of it. How often do you think they're coming now? Oh, I feel like three minutes or something. Because mm. I literally just had the other one. Okay. Alright, so we're setting up downstairs. Okay. You ready for this? <laughs> I am. I, I guess you like are. needs to be up. <laughs> oh. Well, the night is still young. Yeah. We will see. We will see. We will see. <laughs> Mum, any words? Any words? Yes, yes. I'm excited. Never been through this before. <laughs> so it's the first time I'm going to see. Yeah. Oh, boy. As a matter of fact, first time I'm going to see a real life book. Oh. So I'm excited. My yeah. prayer is that God's presence be here as He brings life into the world. Yes, That's amen. Mom is just tidying up a little bit, of course. Um, we'll have to have the midwives in. And so we'll have to have some biscuits out for them and coffee, which we don't have. <laughs> What are you doing? Okay. How are the contractions? They are very fast. They come in a very much shorter intervals now. Mm -hmm. I feel one coming on right now, actually. Mm. Breathe it through, Ooh, breathe it through. That. The liners on the birthing pool. Yeah. You're filling it up. <laughs> we have now called the midwife, and um, one of them, the midwife, is on their way. So they should be with us shortly. Our pool is now filled. <laughs> Oh, I 
Oeh, hoe is die inderdaad? All the candles in <laughs> bright away. Yes, just now we're gonna only have candles. I wanna put on my music as well. My playlist I'm using the same one from last time. You still have it saved? Yeah, it's still on my phone. Birthday playlist. <laughs> Okay, so let me jump right in. This part wasn't recorded because everything just went so quickly after this, so I'm just gonna give you guys a little snapshot of what happened in between here. So the midwives, they got here at around 12.55 a.m. and uh, they began setting up. They brought with them some gas and air and uh, they also had some equipment for resuscitation of, of the baby just in case there was an emergency. They talked with us for a while, they took the details of my pregnancy and they examined me. And by, by the time that was done, you know, it sounds simple, but by the time that was done, it was about an hour. When they did those checks, I was just about five centimeters dilated and i was just about ready to get into the pool when they were done i was just ready to relax to turn the lights off and just have my candle lights going and turn on my music it was probably too relaxing because as soon as i got into the birthing pool i felt a huge contraction and my waters broke and just after that, I had another huge contraction and uh, there was a huge whoosh and baby came out. Did a somersault, like flipped in the water and floated right up and the midwives grabbed, <laughs> the midwives grabbed him. I was shocked, the midwives were amazed and as much as it was everything that we prayed for, it was just really hard to believe that it happened the way it did. From the time I got into the birthing pool to when baby was born, it was actually just around seven minutes. And that seven minutes was really significant for us because when we were having Ezra, the length of time it took between us entering the birthing room and having Ezra was also seven minutes. So all in all, baby was born at 2.02. And we pick up with the video from here. Let's get some little pictures. Oh we'll just pop that into there. Ah, lovely. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. I can't believe it. I think that's the most beautiful birth I've ever seen. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, amazing, so amazing, amazing job. as well downstairs. Wake up and see what's happening. Yeah. Yeah, 
Oh, is this the first of baby week? No, you are bad night. That's right. Oh, <laughs> oh, Two off, 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 by my fatherly intuition, <laughs> we had a boy. Well, our second son now. Yeah. <laughs>